How and where we work has certainly changed. No secret after the pandemic, uh, there's a lot less need for office space. Co-working space is now the direction many are headed. The concept is not new, but it is new to Pine Bluff. And Frederick Price shows us tonight one business owner who believes opening a shared workspace in that city could be beneficial. Travis Mosler is a business owner in Pine Bluff. I own and operate an advertising and marketing agency. Like many entrepreneurs are finding out, a big and oftentimes expensive office space isn't always necessary these days. So I had an office space, but after a pandemic, most of my uh, workers are contract and remote. So he's ending his lease and transforming this old car dealership into a shared workspace. It's known as a co-working space. He calls it the workstation. Some of them have their own independent businesses, small businesses. They, they work out of their house. They meet clients at the library or a restaurant. Mosler calls these people the movers and shakers. They can pay $25 a day to use the space or $195 membership. We'll expand some of the building out. Up he showed me this work in progress. So we've got this big awning where they used to park cars under. We're going to expand this building out under there to create multiple meeting spaces. This is what the renovated building would look like. He adds this space is an example of the amount of opportunity that exists in Pine Bluff for new business owners. Unless you're a billion dollar company, opportunity doesn't really look like Northwest Arkansas. It looks like Pine Bluff, Arkansas. And because this is the first of its kind in the city, he believes it would add to the overall growth. There's services and products that should be here that aren't and that the community really wants to see. Already, he's receiving interest, and he's hoping to have this open and ready to go by this summer. Frederick Price, THV 11 News.